heading down the hill. And I see this gopher snake sunning himself in the middle of the dirt road. You can see him heading down this, this road right here. And there he is. I'm going to try to get a little bit closer to him. I don't know how close I'll get before he gets wind of me. He doesn't even know I'm here. I'm about four feet away from him right now. sitting in the middle of the road getting some sun warming up for the evening and uh, it's about 72 degrees right now it's going to be kind of chilly tonight so I'm gonna get try to get a little bit closer to him and, uh, this may look like a very boring video but I tell you one thing for sure this is how you do it will not be disturbed until I'm ready to go home and uh, he's had enough sun so I'm going to try not to disturb, disturb his sunlight and he needs the warmth for the night <laughs> but anyhow just trying to be kind to the snakes I have not disturbed him he's been right there ever since I first saw him he has not moved I think he knows I'm here because he flicked his tongue a couple of times but uh, I imagine he doesn't perceive me as a threat. So he's going to get all the sunlight he needs before he goes in. And if he sits here too long, I'm going to chase him off. Okay, well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to back off and he's letting me get this close to him and he's not moving. He must need the sun. So I'm going to back off and go sit in the truck and wait for him to move. And he's not gone in about 20 or 30 minutes. I think I'll just move on. Maybe I'll take a nap or something. <laughs> well, he finally moved a little bit. And uh, I'm trying to get him off the road because I need to get going. Come on. Come on. Go. <laughs> Go ahead. It's all right. It's okay, buddy. There he goes. He's off. Alright. Now I get to go home. <laughs>